Hello there. Uh, today I'm gonna show you my PC desktop gaming uh, for about two thousand dollars, <coughs> and uh, I choose this desktop because it has some further features like uh, one hundred and twenty gig of RAM, so you can add for after a while. Uh, up to 128 gig of RAM and uh, that's useful I think that is too useful and uh, for this I choose the core Intel Core i7 5 5820K which uh, is about $400 in US $420 something like that it's uh, this one here Intel Core i7 5820K it has 6 cores and 12 threads which is good for this process processor from 5th uh, generation and uh, the memory uh, I choose uh, Samsung 850 EVO 1TB one, one which is about 150 bucks in US dollars um, it's pretty cheap for today uh, and uh, it provides 5 year war warranty and a great performance and of course it has 1 terabyte which is more than enough um, and for the second storage I choose Western Digital Black Edition 4 terabyte which has a 5 year warranty also and 7 to uh, 7 2000 rpm re which is in is about uh, 250 bucks something like that uh, it's powerful it has 60 month uh, warranty and it's it's great it's a great drive it's built for performance <coughs> um, the next the motherboard uh, which I choose is the MSI 899A Gaming 7 Satya 2000 P3 model which is about uh, uh, 250 bucks for something something like uh, 300, 300 bucks sorry 300 bucks and uh, it has three year warranty this one you can see here that it can uh, update up to uh, one two three four six five uh, one two three five six seven eight slots for memory and each one of si 16 gig up to 16 gig and offer uh, from DDR4 uh, starting frequency 2133 up to 3200 3, frequency memory um, the next is uh, memory which I choose the 32 gig Kingston hyper fury 2 or 16 gig which is uh, 150 bucks something like that 150 bucks with the option to upgrade up to 128 gig of RAM which it's good in the future it's really good or you can update 64 gigs of RAM 4 or 16 gig at the uh, clock at 3200 megahertz and this one will cost uh, for about uh, almost 300 bucks 20 280 uh, 280 bucks the source is the power supply is uh, Corsair 850 watts for about uh, 60 70 bucks which is good it provides great uh, great power for this price the tower 
the uh, case I choose a full tower case which is which looks pretty great for the money um, it space it has a lot of space so you can if you want to add more hard drive or uh, I don't know sound cards video cards um, it has mm, a plenty of space of space with one year warranty this one costs about 40 bucks and the video card is uh, I choose from Asus GTX 970 in the 4 gig 4 gig variant so it's uh, 400 bucks or you can uh, buy GTX 980 4 gig for about uh, 550 bucks the cooler for processor costs for around uh, 40 bucks and is uh, this one or this one they are both good and big well, I choose for air cooling because it's much cost effective and the performance between them isn't that it, um, the difference between this and the water cooling isn't that uh, isn't that big and the total cost is uh, two thousand bucks this is two thousand dollars for 32 gig variant and the gtx 970 and for 64 gig variant and gtx 980 the cost is about two thousand and uh, three hundred bucks this is my gaming pc uh, made in april 2016 thank you very much